Incoming! Get those children into cover! One. So where's that help? We're almost at your position. As if we got soldiers right behind us. Ajay, protect the sappers heading your way. They will disable the guns.
That said, you're in the clear. They would have flattened Utkash if it wasn't for you. <sighs> I don't think people really know how much they owe you, Ajay. <sighs> You've earned yourself a break. <laughs> but a small one. If you have any unfinished business left, I suggest you take care of it. Kirat will need your undivided attention for this final push. Dispatch the animal! from the Ministry of Public Affairs and Social Harmony. Pagan Min urges all loyal Kirati civilians to stay home during this time of crisis. The threat level from the Golden Path is high and it is best to limit travel for emergencies and work. This is for your own safety. May Pagan's light shine upon us all. <laughs> announcement from the Ministry of Public Affairs and Social Harmony. Pagan Min wishes to remind you that he is still firmly in control of Kirat. The Golden Path may claim that his influence is faltering, but do not believe their lies. To question Pagan Min is to commit an act of high treason. The punishment for treason is severe. May Pagan's light shine upon you all. So noisy at night.
Your business is appreciated. The following is an announcement from the Ministry of Public Affairs and Social Harmony. Kirat needs you now more than ever. The Golden Path's reign of terror has reached epidemic proportions and must be stopped. Begin Min himself urges you to enlist with the Royal Army to stem this tide of evil. Join him and put an end to this tyranny. May Begin's light shine upon you all. Where's everyone? At the Kalesh. We're getting ready for the final push. This is it. Win or lose. Sabal is splitting the Golden Path. He's jeopardizing our future, Ajay. Enough is enough. Are you asking me to... I'm telling you to kill him. I'm being very particular with my words, Ajay. Don't let him snake out of this. Besides, did you really think he was going to be okay with you betraying him and siding with me? No. We can't afford to let Sabal live. Ajay, be careful. The Golden Path needs you. I need you. Megan, what do you want? Home. I'm merely calling to check up on you. I hear your little friends are having a bit of a spat. It must be hard. What with you in the middle of it all? Choices are difficult. Trust me, I've been there. In fact, you should be grateful for the choices I've made. Choices like humor. I went on live television to serve her up to you, and I know television. Radio is so much more my thing. And you, mm, you jumped on the opportunity. Poor human, she will be missed. It was a tough call to make, picking you over her. But it was the right call. We'll see. Of course, you're in a hurry. Places to go, shit to tear up. <laughs> I'll let you get back to it. But don't forget, RJ. Choices have consequences. Ajay, I want you to know I did not make this decision lightly. Sabal will never give up on his beliefs. And if he's allowed to live, it will only be a matter of time before he starts an insurgency of his own. Killing him will help to unify the Golden Path and prevent a second civil war from breaking out moments after we end our 